We're in the north of Scotland. Some might say we're in the remote north, but we really don't feel that we are remote at all. I'm Jackie Kay, poet, playwright and novelist, and this is Helmsdale, a town of 800 people whose lives have been enriched and sustained over the last year by its cultural centre, Time Span. Join me as we discover why it is deservedly in the running to win Art Fund Museum of the Year 2021. There are so many community groups that use Time Span in so many different ways. It is wonderful to have a hub that can be used for music, for knitting, for meetings, for all sorts of things. One of our strong points, I think, is that we're very intergenerational. Time Span is essentially what interconnects our community and what interlinks everyone in our village. The thing of working in a rural community is that you're really aware that like, young people don't have access to things that are going to help them grow. And I think that's really central to what we do, is you're making them grow as people so that they can have critical skills when they go out into the world. Time Span works in valuable ways with local people and is constantly looking beyond its borders, campaigning for global issues and social change. Cultural institutions have a big responsibility in responding to urgent contemporary crisis which there are no shortage of. We were in a very strong position to respond to the pandemic. So we know our community because we're at the heart of everything we do. And we're a wee organisation who are agile enough to be sort of quick-footed in response. Our local resilience group actually approached Timespan and said, we have over 150 households that are sheltering at the moment. We got a local history book, packs of archival photographs, and we also made heritage quizzes, and we organised home deliveries, not just in the village, the rural countryside as well. The photographs were a huge success. People were phoning each other all around the village and discussing these photos, which was just what we wanted. It was very nice, very nice. And this is my father's boat with all the crew on it. Time Span wants to tell the story of its surroundings, how its history has been connected to issues of repatriation and land distribution. It isn't afraid to tackle the big subjects through a local lens. An important principle of Time Span is that we have to reconfigure our history within a global framework. We initiated our online exhibition, Real Rights, which tells the history of our parish within the intersection of climate change and colonialism. The Real Rights exhibition was actually going to be a physical exhibition, but that wasn't possible last year. By putting the exhibition online, it became far more accessible. People could actually interact with our heritage, but they were doing it from their home. As some light relief, we came up with our quarantine cooking show, Recipes for a Disaster, so our locals could access their inner Nigella and share their favourite recipes. I hope the win in London. <laughs> and coming to the awards ceremony. Yes. <laughs> Time Span is an inspiring example of an arts organisation that gets its hands dirty in the important work. It's my Art Fund Museum of the Year.